guys, welcome to Rob Squad Reactions with your boy Jay. And your girl Amber. And we're back today with another reaction video suggested to us by you guys. Our amazing RSR family. But today, guys, we have someone who is new artist alert here on the channel. Y'all said he was really, really good buddies with Frank Sinatra. So we have to check him out. I guess maybe along the same style? We'll see. I have no idea. We're brand new into this. Tell me what we got. So the song is Big Bad John, and the artist is Jimmy Dean. And I think of the sausage when I think of Jimmy Dean. I didn't even think about that Jimmy Dean <laughs> I think Dean of Jimmy Dean sausage. sausage. I think I'm hungry. All right. I have no idea what we're getting into. What was the song called? Big, Big Bad, Bad John. John. Let's go ahead and check it out again. If you are new here From to the, the channel, 60s. hit that subscribe button. Let's check out Big Bad John by Jimmy Dean. Big John, Big John. Every morning at the mine, you could see him arrive. He stood six foot six and weighed 245, kind of broad at the shoulder and narrow at the hip. And everybody knew you didn't give no lip to Big John. Big John, Big John. Big Bad John, Big John. Nobody seemed to know where John called home. He just drifted into town and stayed all alone. He didn't say much. He kind of quiet and shy. And if you spoke at all, you just said hi to Big John. Somebody said he came. This is cool. Uh, the undertone to it and then the storytelling that goes along with it is so, so good. And he... He's got that depth to his voice that's perfect for storytelling. Oh my gosh, I really like it. Um, it just gives me that front porch sitting Big storytelling John. vibe. I had this amazing coach, rest in peace, Coach Johnson, who would sit and just tell stories almost like this. He had one called Daddy's Roly Poly, something like that. But he, it was with this same kind of cool cadence, and it just kind of gives you that, you know, sitting on your front porch, listen to somebody tell you the story, and you're all leaned in and super engaged. Like, I'm engaged with this. No, right it's cool, a big job. Yeah. Well, he said, that's a big man, too. That's and y'all know, man. we love storytelling. Yeah. I'll say, we've done so many. A Boy Named Sue, Hot Rod Lincoln, like the storytelling cool, songs though. are cool. Oh, what was the one, the old western one? Uh, oh, Poncho and Lefty. Poncho and Lefty. That's what it was. In New Orleans, where he got in a fight over a Cajun queen and a crashing blow from a huge right hand sent a Louisiana fella to the promised land, Big John. Big John. Big John. Big Bad John. Big John. Then came the day at the bottom of the mine when a timber cracked and men started crying. Manners were praying and hearts beat fast and everybody thought that they'd breathe their last, except John. Except John. Through the dust and the smoke of this man-made hell walked a giant of a man that the miners knew well, grabbed a sagging timber and gave out with a groan and like a giant oak tree just stood there alone, Big John. <gasps> I like it. Yeah. Big John, Big Bad John, Big John. And with all of his strength, he gave a mighty shove. Then a miner yelled out, there's a light up above. And 20 men scrambled from a would-be grave. Now there's only one left down there to save Big John. And it was going to be Big John. Oh, I knew that Oak Tree Man was going to be the John. last one. This is, this is so, so cool. I love it. I love when songs don't get in a hurry. And there's, like, no hurry to this. this it's is very simple, too. Simple. And, like, from just the, the light drums to just his voice and the, the big, bad John. You know how they, they'll chime in. Like, everything about big it John. is super simple. Ooh, that's a big but part. Yeah, but you're super engaged in everything about it. And it's just this easy pace. He's not in a hurry. You feel like you're you're getting the full story. He's not rushing it. We're going to get to the end of this story. We're going to find out about it. I feel like we're all, like, it gives me just the picture of a bunch of guys sitting around, guy, guys sitting on a milk crate telling the story. Yeah, I, that, I just, that, that's, cool. what I that's what I call front porch. You call it milk crate. I, I call we it tell stories on the porch. milk crate. We sit on the milk crates and listen. <laughs> With Jackson Timbers, they started back down. Then came that rumble way down in the ground. And the smoke and gas belched out of that mine. Everybody knew it was the end of the line for Big John. Big John. Big John. Big Bad John. 
Now they never reopened that worthless pit, they just placed a marble stand in front of it. These few words are written on that stand. At the bottom of this mine lies a big, big man. Big John. John. Big John. Big John. Big bad John. Big John. That was cool. I liked it. You know, that's that's another storytelling song that we could definitely add to our collection of, like I said earlier, Hot, uh, Hot Rod Lincoln, Boy Named Sue. Yeah. There's so many to name that we've done. And you guys know that we love the storytelling type of songs. Well, like there that. was another one about uh, Poke Salad. Poke Salad Poke Annie. Poke Salad Annie. I yes. really, this, this one and Poke Salad Annie. No, Poke Salad Annie is probably one of my favorites. Uh. They reminded me a lot of each other just because of the southern sound and, and just the, the pace in which they sang. And the you know how, how everything was super mm. simple. And that's also a testament to the 60s. I mean, you, you got to just kind of sit there, settle in, trust in the story. No, we ain't going too fast. We're going to be here for a while. We're going to learn. What happens to Big John? We got Big John's whole life story. This big and, burly man. And Jimmy Dean just had he has that old school this depth or range to to, yeah. to his voice. Like hey, you know, it almost like like a wisdom. You know, uh, like wisdom. Like well, that's it, what I'm it, saying. It, like, like, you like, want to trust wisdom. in his story. Yes, you want to like, trust in the story. And just this pronunciation. I know it's weird how he said Big Bad John. Just the mm -hmm. emphasis and how he like how it just rolled off his tongue. You're like that's that was probably one of my favorite parts. But overall, in general, I love the the down home feeling. I love the storytelling. I love how easy the pace was and just him in general. He did have a voice that I would pick a storybook out and be like, yes. okay, no, narrate Jimmy it Dean. for me. Narrate it for yeah, me. Yeah, listen, I want to tell me the story of Three Little Pigs now, Jimmy. <laughs> Guys, drop down in the comments. Let us know what our next Jimmy Dean song should be. Or and, storytelling. And question. Did he have anything to do with the sausage? I, the <laughs> questions that need answered. But guys, thank you so, so much for that suggestion as we always send you guys out of here every day, not once or twice, but... Three, y'all. We love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every single day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed no matter what the circumstances are. And those of you that are new here, hit that subscribe button down below. We welcome you guys to the RSR family. But y'all have a goal every day, just like we do. Tell them that goal, Mom. Super important. Very important. Make sure you do this today. Make somebody smile. We love you guys. Until next time, we'll see y'all later.